Hello YouTube, welcome back to my new video. Here in this tutorial video you are going to see the procedure on how you can reinstall Windows 10 without being delete your software, personal files or settings. Windows 10 reinstallation, also known as a Windows 10 in place upgrade or Windows 10 repair install, can be used to reload Windows 10 system files registry keys, and configuration to a known working state without the deletion or removal of user files, settings, and software. There are many reasons why you might want to reinstall Windows. Reinstalling Windows 10 can usually make your PC as good as new, or even better. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please hit the red subscribe button down below and hit the bell to get notification of my new videos. So, without any further ado, let's get started. In case if your device is not working well and you are not sure what is causing, or if you experience any kind of weird behavior. Weird behavior like, Windows 10 Start Menu not working. Windows 10 Metro Apps not working. Corrupt system files due to viruses. Failed Windows 10 Updates and Upgrades. Bad Windows Update. The reinstallation can be initiated from within Windows from the media creation tool, and the process took around half an hour to finish on our desktop PC. For this, visit the download Windows 10 page and download the media creation tool. After launching the media creation tool, you'll have the choice to upgrade now or to create an installation media. You want to upgrade this PC now. Currently installed software on the repaired operating system, make sure that apps are listed and not only files, keep personal files and apps. The rest of the in-place upgrade amounts to waiting about a half an hour for Windows to reinstall, which rebooted our system several times and didn't require any further intervention from us. Clear to see from up here, the world seems small. We can sit together, it's so beautiful. You and me, we meant to be in the great outdoors. Forever free
When completed, you load back into the same Windows environment where you originally started the upgrade, except with newly installed operating system files which should be bug free. Now my Windows 10 has been also upgraded with reinstallation from version 1803 to 1903. After completing the in-place upgrade or reinstallation of Windows 10, as mentioned before, although this reinstallation retains your software and settings, the process creates a Windows.all folder with data from your previous copy of Windows. This folder occupies a large amount of storage and isn't easily deleted directly from File Explorer, though you can browse the contents at c colon backslash windows.old. Disk cleanup can delete the windows.old folder as well as other temporary installation files used in the setup. Search the start menu for disk cleanup and then click cleanup system files to run a secondary scan that will locate windows junk files. When we scanned after the in-place upgrade, Disk Cleanup found 18.7 GB of previous Windows installations. If you're really low on storage space, you can remove previous installations to make some space. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and comment. It would be great to know your opinions about my tutorials. Also, you can make requests for new tutorials. See you soon.